Hey everyone, here is a quick tutorial on how to create campaigns. Now, I'm just in the new site right now. I've clicked on card catalog over here and it's taken me to this site. You'll see on the left hand side we have a campaign store. So if you want to purchase a campaign that's already created, you can just hop right into the store and choose uh, your genre and choose a campaign and purchase one. And there's campaigns for sale that are one touch, three touch, five touch, seven touch cards. And uh, what those cards, uh, we, we, once you purchase them, you can uh, make them yours, personalize them, and then you can click send, and those cards will go out throughout the year, however you've set them up to do so, and uh, just make it easy peasy for you to send cards. So uh, that's our campaign store. Uh, but if you want to create your own campaign, you can just click on campaigns right here. This is in the new site. And as we're going through adjustments between a uh, new site and old site, I'm just going to show you how it works in the new way. And then I'm going to hop into the back and I'm going to let you uh, show you how to create a campaign from the old site as well. So uh, here you'll see purchase campaigns. So if you have gone to the campaign store, this is where your purchase campaigns will show up. You can also click on my campaigns and this is where your campaigns which you've already created or you create will show up. You'll just want to click on the plus symbol here and that is going to take you to give it a name. And here I'm just going to call this campaign uh, 31 ways and I'm going to create the campaign and uh, here it says add card so I'll just click add card and now I can choose a card here or I can totally build my own. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and I'm going to build my own. And so I'll click photo here, customize card. I can choose what kind of card I want. I'm gonna choose a standard card, two panel. Uh, actually, I'm gonna do a three panel card for this one and click next. And then I'll click here on your photo here and you'll see if you've already uploaded the images, I'm just going to upload these images. And uh, what I've done is just created a few different uh, images here for 31 different ways that you can use send out cards. And uh, we've created this, actually a few of us got together and created it. Uh, this is great for realtors and uh, we've created a specific for realtors actually so we've just created these 31 ways and i'm just going to upload these images that i have saved on my desktop and uh, then i'm going to walk you through sending a card or rather creating a campaign card so now that i've uploaded those images i'm just going to click on the uh front here and this is what i want to uh, this is what I want the front of my card to look like. And then I'll just tap here and I'm gonna grab the image and make sure I have the right one. There's number one. Uh, you would just do the same. So I'm just creating this card. Now the reason why I'm gonna create a campaign card is because I want uh, to send this card to lots of people. And so I'm going to uh, call this a campaign and every time I, I set up a realtor, I'm gonna send them this card. And so I'll just click on, just keep creating this here, click on the back panel. I love these uh, three panel cards are so beautiful. And there we go. So uh, the one more panel on the back is that uh, this is up to you. This is where you're gonna put your branding. So I'm just going to uh, leave the branding as my branding and uh, anyone can change your branding to whatever they like. And I'm gonna click add to campaign. And now that has created a campaign called 31 ways to use send out cards. I can send it out immediately. 
So it's really that easy. If I wanted to attach another uh, another card here, maybe that went out three months from now, saying uh, maybe I would call it another 31 ways to use send out cards uh, for personal life or uh, for any business or uh, 31 more ways to use send out cards in real estate, I can do that. Uh, I can add that card so you know uh, you can create more than one in fact you can create as many cards as you like so here I would click add a card and I would uh, I would I would do just what I did just create another card and uh, and just go from there so this is that it's it's really that simple uh, I'll just uh, I'm all finished here with my with my custom card I have it selected for immediate this is where I would change the date if I wanted to change the date and uh, I can send it for birthday anniversary send immediately send a specific date uh, then there's some advanced options here you'll see the card type the paper type and uh, and you can also set it up to have a delay uh, different paper options here add a gift yes or no and uh, and there we go. Okay. So now, if I wanted to send that campaign, I would just hop right into my relationship manager, and I would choose. Uh, let's choose. I would choose Dave. And uh, I'm just going to click uh, his name and click campaign and click 31 ways and click submit. And now uh, you'll see that that card is going out to Dave nice and easy. Um, here we go. Done. And ready to send. That's going to charge me. Uh, because it's a campaign card, it's going to charge me the dollar seventy-five plus the postage, uh, eighty-five cents in Canada, for a total of two dollars and sixty-five cents. I just click send, and that card will be on its way. It's that easy, everyone. So, thanks so much for joining us for our campaign example, and have an amazing day.